Hi everyone, thank you for watching Access Hockey Michigan. We joined Jordan Topping today with the Toledo Walleye who's been signed by the Grand Rapids Griffins after a successful season in the WHL, finishing out the 2017-18 season with 80 points with the Tri-City Americans. Jordan is adjusting to the ECHL life in the Pro League and hoping to piggyback off of what he's learned in the prospect tournament and training camp. Listen to what Jordan has to say about what he's hoping to learn and accomplish this season with the Toledo Walleye. We're here with Jordan Topping. He's a player currently with Toledo Walleye and recently signed with the Grand Rapids Griffins. Jordan, thank you so much for uh, hanging out with us today. So we just want to ask you a couple questions about your career um, and how you feel like you're doing and how you feel like you're progressing right now um, and where you see yourself fitting with Grand Rapids in the long term. Yeah, no, I think uh, obviously it's my first kind of go at pro hockey here. So um, there's a lot of adjustments and obviously playing against uh, older guys has been um, kind of a change, but uh, I felt like it's been really good so far. and. Um, obviously, it's nice to be in Toledo here. Mm -hmm. And you had an incredible season last year with the WHL. Um, 80 points, you finished out 2017-18. And what what did you do right there that you're hoping to translate down here? Uh, I think I, you know, I played with some really good players there. Um, you know, it was a it was a good spot for me. Obviously, I was one of the older players on the team, so um, yeah, I just I, I was surrounded with really good players, and uh, you know, I think that that kind of being in the league for a couple of years really helped me, and mm -hmm. um, it was it was really good for my development. Now, what are you doing? Are you doing anything differently now that you are here, adjusting maybe your workouts, your eating habits? What are you trying to learn most while you're here? Uh, I think obviously being uh, I was at Detroit's camp and um, just kind of soaking in like all, everything the pros do on a day-to-day -day mm -hmm. basis. Um, you know, everything that is kind of is is a little bit more uh, more strict here in pro. You got to be you got to do those extra things to to make yourself better. So mm -hmm. um, yeah, just probably the adjustment to that. Mm -hmm. It's definitely more challenging mm -hmm. <laughs> playing yeah. against much larger players yeah, now. Yeah. Now, what is what is the biggest struggle that you've had so far? I know preseason just kicked off in, in practice. Is there anything uh, specifically that you've noticed about yourself that you really got to work on this season? Um, I think just my details, de like on a day-to-day -day basis, my mm -hmm. uh, my practice habits, everything's just um, under a microscope here, so you really got to be be ready to go every day. So, um, you know, for me, kind of from junior, there's, there's not that extra kind of second to, you know, um, have that mistake made or whatever mm -hmm. um, so probably that for me has been the biggest thing mm -hmm. and now going forward um, as the season progresses where where do you see your impact being the the greatest felt for the team what uniquely can you bring um, you know I think I'm a, I'm a big forward who goes to the net and uh, and likes to score obviously I think uh, you know that's a big part of my game is getting around mm -hmm. those areas and uh, getting the getting the greasy goals so um, you know, that's, that's kind of my game and mm -hmm. um, basically just a big power forward. Mm -hmm. 